What's up, Brozones? Welcome to the Ozone, and welcome to another Gravity Falls reaction video. I'm so excited to get into this one. Uh, this is episode number four, five, and six. Genuinely, I have... I, I cannot stop waiting. <laughs> um, I, I just want to get straight into it, but of course, we need to do our little talk before. Um, basically, you guys have been supporting the series so much. Uh, I really, really enjoy being in the premieres, watching along with you guys. Um, obviously, it's not live, but, you know, it's it's nice to be there watching with you guys. And you guys comment weird things like gay visionaire and stuff like that. Anyway, uh, if you're in the premiere right now, hello. Um, hi. And of course, if you don't want to miss a future premiere, for these Gravity Falls reactions, then make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell, why not? And if you become a member as well, for $1 a month, you can see my full uncut reactions to these uh, episodes. Of course, I cannot show the full thing on YouTube because of copyright reasons, so I only show a portion. Yay! All right, I cannot wait any longer. I wanna get straight into season two, episode number four. I have no idea what it's called because I'm not looking at the titles. Let's go. Oh, we're back at the library. All right, Mabel. Today's the big day. Big day! Zeus finally fixed up the laptop. If this thing works, Ooh. we could learn the identity of the author and unravel the greatest mysteries of Gravity Falls. You ready? Oh, I'm ready, baby. Mama. Huh? <laughs> okay. Okay. No way! Uh, of course. Oh no! What's the password gonna be? Ba 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 ba. I do this to sync up the video. <laughs> Fun fact: I'm not just crazy. Well, actually. Okay, great. Let's get in. Hey, hey, be good to each other. We're all stars. Hey, guess who's Mabel? I am. Care to learn more? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mabel. Oh, hey, I'm Gabe. Matt. Oh, I thought he was way older, by the way. <laughs> it's not password. But what about cracking this password? You know, mystery twins? If you help me with this for just a couple of days, I promise- Oh my god, Mabel. Please, pretty please. This is how they drag out the show. They use Mabel as an excuse. <laughs> Man, I can't wait to get to the bottom of this laptop. We're close to something big here. I can feel it. Huh? Huh? What? 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 Why is Bill there? Okay, that was weird. Oh, there's a code there. There's a code there that I need to solve next time. Come on, Dipper. You just gotta roll with Mabel's craziness. It's what makes life worth living. Puppet boy, puppet boy, you're the boy I love. Not even gonna ask. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Oh. Soon, Gabe Benson. That's a bit weird. Ah, oh. <laughs> love this. The two, two perspectives. Ooh, there has to be some shortcut or clue. Who would know about secret codes? Grand Stan. Probably. Or Bill Cipher. Whoa! What? What? Well, well, well. Okay. You're awfully persistent, pine tree. Hats off to you. <laughs> okay. Love this. Admit it, you missed me. I missed you. You deserve a prize. Here, have a head that's always screaming. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. Want to hear my impression of you in about three seconds? <laughs> <laughs> I can't. 
This is amazing. I did not expect to see Bill Cipher so early on. Get me my lunch roller. Oh, hey, you just said you were going to help me. Dipper, this sock crisis just bumped up to a cold Oh, Mabel. Come on. I seriously think that your random crush of the week is more important than uncovering the mystery? Exactly. I'm with Dipper on this one. Well, I can help you with tickles. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Season one, I preferred Mabel. Season two, I prefer Dipper. It's really strange. I love the Bill Cipher behind. Is useless. <gasps> oh man. Too many failed entries. Huh? I was wondering when this is gonna happen. No, 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 no. I'm gonna lose everything? I only have one more try? Oh no. Well, 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 well. Someone's looking desperate. <laughs> Besides, what's your sister done for you lately? How many times have you sacrificed for her, huh? And when has mm. she ever returned the favor? I mean, he's actually kind of right. Fine. So what puppet are you gonna pick anyway? Hmm, let's see. Eeny, meeny, miny. Ow! What? <laughs> what? This can't be happening! Oh no. Kid, but you're my puppet now. <laughs> oh my gosh, this can't be happening. Oh no! What? It's been so long since I've inhabited a body. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Pain is hilarious. <laughs> Pain is hilarious. <laughs> Look, kid, you've been getting way too close to figuring out some major answers. What can he do? So where do you keep that journal anyway? It's got to be around here somewhere. <laughs> Boy, these arms are durable. Pain is hilarious. It's my new favorite line. Journal to use as a prop in the show. I hope you don't mind. I'm going to go before you process the sentence. Okay, bye. You're basically a ghost. Oh, hey, Dipper. There you are. What? I love how he's stood like Bill Cipher. You know, he's got that pose where he's like, yeah. <laughs> like. But how can you stop me? If you don't exist. <laughs> so maybe that is Bill's motivation is to, to inhabit a body. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's Mabel. Hi hey there! Did you say stable? No, you said Mabel. <laughs> Who's that girl with the pig and the braces? She puts smiles on everyone's faces. <laughs> what else? What did Bill say? I can't be heard without a vessel? Where would I find a... Oh... Huh. <laughs> what is that? Mabel, it's me, Dipper. You need to help me. Wait, what? Dipper? But you're so much more of a sock than usual. <laughs> he stole my body and now he's after the journal. You have to find the journal before Bill destroys it. It's the only hope to get me back in my body. But my cue's coming up any minute. Shut up, Mabel. Maybe later you could join me for a biscotti? <gasps> you drive a biscotti? I'll be waiting. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> you drive a biscotti? Biscotti is biscuit, cookies. <laughs> Sorry, it, look, it looks funny when you're mad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Just, just take over for me until I get I back. don't like that Mabel doesn't take these things seriously, to be honest. It's her brother, like... Okay, good. She is taking it seriously. Oh, but why would you want to do that? <gasps> Bill Dipper. Bipper. Bipper. <laughs> there it is. I mean, who would sacrifice everything they worked for just for their dumb sibling? Mabel. Dipper, I won't like you at all anymore. Okay. Whoa. 
Children fighting. I can sell this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm glad Mabel's fighting back. Okay. Pickle, pickle. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting, he doesn't know what it's like to be in a body. Flesh sticks, body, shutting down. So he is trying to... Mosquito bites. To, to get, like, a vessel. Whoa, 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 hey! hey, hey. <laughs> I'm surprised we didn't see a shot of Grunkle Stan being like, no! Like another clue that maybe there was two stands or something. I've seen enough movies to know this is the part where the audience thinks it was all part of the show and loves it. Cue applause! <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Come on, it was almost cool. Don't speak to me, Mabel. You've made a mockery of my art form. Shut the hell up. Did he just make out with his puppets? I might have dodged a bullet. Yeah, I was about to say. The unfortunate part is he doesn't have the laptop anymore. Seriously, I need to go to the hospital. Hey, Dipper. What did one soft puppet say to the other? Hey, yo. Puppet? I don't know, Mabel. What? You look like you could use a hand. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. That's great. That joke was really something. Yeah, something terrible. <laughs> <laughs> that was her dream. Oh my god, that was amazing. Oh, that was such a good episode. I genuinely really really enjoyed that that was so enjoyable um bill's back already like i i he's gonna come back again and again i feel like the villain of season one was gideon and i, I mean we haven't even really seen gideon this season we've seen him in one shot right at the beginning maybe he'll come back but i feel like the villain of season two is bill cypher i think bill cypher is going to keep coming back in a few episodes and it, I'm I'm loving it. I'm loving Bill Cipher. To be honest, favorite character. <laughs> He's just so insane and so cool. I think I know that's like a probably a pretty standard and boring answer in um, the Gravity Falls community. But Bill Cipher is just like a character that can't be beaten. He's just perfect in every single way. He's freaking hilarious, uh, and he. he he has the flexibility to do whatever he wants, really. And that's what I love about him. And I love his voice. Um, it's, it's just, it's really funny. <laughs> Pain is hilarious. <laughs> All right, we're going to do the secret code. Are you kidding me? Oh, God. You have got to be kidding me. Well, good thing I have a new... Decipherer <laughs> uh, or decoder because uh, this is long like even copying this down is gonna take so long. Oh And I just realized I never actually Found the key I Never actually found the key so I need to go back and find the key um, This episode was called sock opera by the way. Uh, I mean makes sense the thing is with finding the keys is genuinely could be anywhere. There's the code, by the way, like this is, this is definitely a code 100% and the circle word is going to be important and the underlined words are going to be important. Um, the code could literally be anywhere in any shot and I could really easily miss it if I, if I go too quick. Um, so I really need to look out for for a key, uh, obviously, but like, 
I'm, I'm assuming it's going to be in like a new location. I, I'm guessing it's not going to just randomly be in their bedroom, if you know what I mean. This shot, so cool. Like, what? I didn't even realize he was like in a... Is he in a dream? I, I guess he's not in a dream, but like... I don't know. I, I, I can't tell. I, I'm assuming this is like a dreamland and it was actually a nightmare. But like, I don't really know how to interpret that whether it is actually reality and it's just like a distorted version, but I don't know. My question as well is like, is there a pattern to the keys? Like, is the, it... I, like, I'm wondering if there is always like a certain place that a key will appear. Um, but like, I can't see a pattern with the previous episodes. Because the first one was in prison. The second one was on a barrel in the... Uh, bunker. The third one was uh, on like the, the castle at mini golf. So I'm assuming this one is going to be like in the play, or, like on the stage or like backstage or just like somewhere around here because I cannot see it being in like an old location that we've seen many times before because like why would they just randomly put code there? I don't know. Um, Hmm. Okay, I'm not admitting defeat just yet. Uh, I am going to try and find the key in a minute, but I've been through the whole episode once already and I, I need to go back through and just kind of really have a closer look. Um, but I'm going to take the screenshot and work out this code first. So here, I think, is our fourth of... Now, hang on a second, because... Maybe it's not. Oh! Oh, wait. So, no. No, it's it's not. Because you'll see. You'll see just down here. There's actually no corner. So, it's actually more like this. It's like one, two, three, four. So, maybe it'll be five, six. Like, is it making... Is it making a six episode... I don't know, like, I, I don't know, because you, you see this triangle here, like, this is making a shape. Hmm. Intriguing. Intriguing, to say the least. All right, now time to type out this really, really long number code. Oh my gosh. Well, to anyone wondering how long this is, it's actually had to go on two lines uh, as I was typing it out, but it's it's this long. It's twice as long as the other ones. <laughs> so this is, this is, this is long. But we're gonna copy this and hopefully, now I've made it so you can put it into here and it will just work straight away. Okay, here we go. It has worked, but I think it's too long. <laughs> Uh, no worries, I don't think. Uh, although, is it a thing of... Yeah, I think it's this formula is just not pulled far enough. Okay. So, we're, we're going to get there. We're going to get there. E-D-I-F. Okay. Uh, oh, God. Okay. Hold on. So, this needs to be pulled down. Nope. Not like that. <laughs> well, dude, so I have turned myself into a FNAF YouTuber. <laughs> yeah. Okay, hopefully this works now. Oh my gosh, it's still not long enough. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Okay, I just need to make this as long as possible, really. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay, I think I'm there. And then I can make this longer. Okay. It says... No puppet strings can hold me down. Abnormal soon will be the norm. So patiently I watch this town. Enjoy... Wait. On joy the calm before the storm. Okay, wait, I need to type this out. Okay, so I think what I've actually done is I've accidentally... So so basically what's happened, I think, 
is I've done this top section, top left, and then bottom left, and then top right, bottom right. But I think it's actually top left, top right, bottom left, bottom right. So I think I've just done it in a weird order. So I think it should be no puppet strings can hold me down. So patiently I watch this town and then it's abnormal soon will be the norm. Enjoy the calm before the storm. I think that's what it is. I think it's two, two different sets almost. So that's cool. Why is it an enjoy, not an enjoy? I think I might've just written it down wrong maybe. Uh, I think it's the I, oh my gosh, okay. Uh, in, enjoy, nine, 10. So I think it's, so nine, 10, 14, nine. Nine, 10, 14, nine. Okay, so should it be nine, 10, 14, nine? Nine, 10, 14, nine, 10, Oh my gosh. Wait, where's it gone? Where's it gone? I don't see it. It's literally disappeared. Okay. Well, fantastic. Oh, what? Okay. 9, 10. Oh, it's 19, 10. That's why. So it's 19, 10. So I just missed out a one. So it's going to be, oh my gosh, this is, this is still quite hard to navigate, but it's, it's worth it. Um, so instead of nine ten, it's nineteen. Okay, I ruined it. <laughs> so it's nineteen ten. Soon will be the norm. So patiently, I watch this town. Enjoy the calm before the storm. Okay, cool. So it's enjoy. <sighs> okay, now we've solved that code. Woo! What's next? The freaking key. That I, I need to find the key. Oh my God. <laughs> Me literally going through the entire episode frame by frame. Freaking 20 minutes later, I find it. Oh my God. Okay. This is, <laughs> these, these are dull, dull moments. Okay. The worst part is I think this is the part where he's like, Ha! Pain is, pain is hilarious. It is literally that part. It's the part I was laughing at the whole time. And literally, in the corner of my eye, it says Cypher. Oh my god, that scared me. <laughs> it accidentally, it accidentally played. Um, yeah, okay. <sighs> so, it it's Cypher. So, and it's strange that that's backwards too. Although I guess it's in a mirror. Okay, so fine. So, Cypher is our, and I haven't even written the code down yet because it's it's so long. <laughs> oh, this is so painful. Oh, I need to get some like image recognition or something on this. I need to be able to take a screenshot and it will give me all my letters for me. But no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna manually type it out again. Okay, see you in 40 minutes. Oh my God, it's literally four lines. Like the, the largest we had before was from, uh, oh my gosh, that was the, that was this puberty thing. So this, this is a, this is a very long one. Uh, you guys weren't lying when you said that this is a, a much more like, um, secret, like secret code centric series or season, sorry. Um, and that the codes get a lot harder because this is ridiculous. Uh, I'm, I'm not saying it's harder at the moment. I'm just saying like, well, actually, no, it is because finding the key is ridiculous. And then everything after that is just a bonus. All right. So why am I putting it in there? Obviously, it's a visionaire. Uh, <laughs> Is this gonna be able to do a code so long? Oh my gosh, it's not, it's not gonna be able to do it. But Cypher is our Cypher. So we we have it. We will. Ah. We will had some fun tonight, but 
Let's not forget who... Okay, yeah, it, and it stops. Uh, I think that's because this needs more. <laughs> it needs more. Bam, 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 bam. Okay, there we go. And then we drag it down. Nobody can drag me down. Okay, there we go. Uh, yes, I am insane. Uh, is that it? Or is that it? Okay, I think that's it. GBI is GBI. Yeah, GBI is the end of it. But why doesn't this... Oh, because... Oh, I just need to do one more. Bam! Uh, <laughs> this is what happens. I, 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 I'm possessed by Bill Cipher. You heard it here first, folks. Okay. So, the <laughs> imagine. Just imagine decoding this all on paper. You have to go through Cypher. Uh, how many times is this? Probably like 25 times. Uh, it's it's insane. So, and I still need to like decode, like, I still need to understand what it's saying. So, we will had, oh wait, we've, never mind. I thought it was like some vampire talking. I thought it was like, we will had some time. <laughs> but no, it's we've all had some fun tonight. But let's not forget. <laughs> I have to scroll down for like every. Let's not forget who there. Who there. Mm -hmm. This is hard. Who there al. Who there al puppet. Ma, ma, master, who there, oh, who, let's not forget who their old puppet master is, uh, oh, yeah, okay, so, <laughs> I need to look at the grammar for this, because obviously, like, you have grammar in, you have grammar, it's not appearing again, what's going on, what, I just, okay, whatever, obviously, there's, like, grammar here, um, but like it's it's really I can't put that in this otherwise it doesn't work. So we've all had some fun tonight, but let's not forget who the real ah oh, it's not there it's the real. Let's not forget who the real puppet master puppet masters are. Reptoids. Reptoids. Who, let's not forget who the real puppet masters are, reptoids who have infiltrated, who have infiltrated our government. Reptoid, what? Rep, oh wait, it's not reptoids at all, it's re, re, no it is, it is, uh, master and then re, man this is so hard to read. Uh, reptoids. What's a reptoid? So yeah, it, it's so yeah. Oh, it, oh, it's it's actually um. Oh, so it's a reptile person. Okay, so it, this is the conspiracy theory that like the queen, uh, is a lizard or something like that. Um, so that's interesting. My question to that is: is that foreshadowing that the the government agents that we saw? are actually lizards. That's a, that's a theory that is out there. <laughs> Maybe that's why one of them doesn't understand humor, <laughs> you know? All right, I am seeing a theme for season two. Every single episode is taking me about one and a half hours to record. So I'm so glad that I, um, I, yeah. I'm I'm basically becoming brain dead <laughs> as as the night goes on. And yes, I say night because I start recording this at like 8 p.m. and I finish at genuinely midnight. So uh cheers to that. I'm gonna get myself another drink. The absolute worst part about this, as I'm thinking about the show, is that it's taken me this long to do the Visionaire ciphers, 
And now I have a system in place and it's still taking me a long time to do it, even though, uh, even though, well, actually, no, no, it's just because that one was really long. Either way, at some point in this show, in this season, the cipher is going to change. So, so, so at some point I'm going to have no idea what I'm doing again. Um, which is the beauty of this show, really. You you evolve over time and you learn to understand the codes and then they throw something else at you. And and that's what I absolutely love about this. And I think it's this is a one-of-a-kind show. I, I really do. I haven't seen anything like it before. And I don't think... I genuinely don't think there is anything like this out there. I know you guys have been uh, asking me to watch The Owl House and Amphibia and... I might do that in my free time, but the reason I love Gra Gravity Falls so much right now is because of the codes, it's because of all these secrets and Easter eggs and stuff like that, the decoding aspect, the, the fact that it's interactive almost, I freaking love it. Um, and I'm, I, I'm going to put it out there, I'm going to be completely honest and open with you guys, and I know I'm saying this when we're literally on season two, episode four, but... I don't really enjoy watching cartoons or like animated shows or, or anything like that. Especially like Disney animated shows. Not into it at all. But Gravity Falls has captivated me. It is really, really interesting. And I, I really can appreciate the animation and the work that's been put into it. I know that the other ones that I mentioned are also uh, related to Alex Hirsch in some way. I think he stars in them or something. But Gravity Falls as a whole... I just love every single part of it, uh, and that's why I'm continuing with it. I genuinely just think it's a one-of-a-kind show. Anyway, let's stop blabbering on. I want to watch episode two of season two. Let's get into it. Oh, wait. Episode two? Episode five. I, I told you I'm losing my mind. <laughs> nice one, Mabel. Oh. Oh, that was... You saved me! Oh, I hated that. Oh, no. Your cousin Reggie is having an engagement party next month. <laughs> Looks exactly like him. I would like to see you settled before I ascend to heaven and live with the angels. And with Grandpa. <laughs> no. I vacuumed to Grandpa. <laughs> You're dead. I'm dead. <laughs> All right, time to sync up the video. <laughs> that was weird. I'm never doing that again. Don't you want to use that nickel to get a nugget from old Goldie? <laughs> Watch this. Agony. <laughs> Is that agony? What? <laughs> what on earth was that? Its face reminds everyone of the inevitability of death. What? True. Sure, he's a little rusty around the edges, but old Goldie's a classic showstopper like me. Huh? <laughs> ah, kill it! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> uh. oh. That merch is great. All right, Seuss, you could do this. Just use your mouth to say words that makes romance happen. Is this a Seuss-centric episode? Your face is good. I'm a Seuss. Well, that went well. But I've never actually been on a date before. You belong on me, out of order sign. Oh. I'm going to cry. <laughs> I cry at everything. Or lie about being rich. Get rich. You're a sweet guy with a steady job and a pickup truck. Would you date him? Oh, would you? <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> oh, Wendy. To the mall! I'm going to go find a replacement for old Goldie. I was about to say, why the hell has he brought that? <laughs> it can't be any worse at this than Dipper. Yeah. Wait. True. Oh, Wendy. I love you, Wendy. <laughs> I'm not scared of your eyes at all. I'm gonna look at them. 
What's he doing? You know, I've uh, actually been in a pig's body. Did you know pigs have a hard time walking backwards? <laughs> Not you, though. Not that I'm calling you a pig. <laughs> I've actually been in a pig's body. Yeah, I remember that. Carpe DM. Freddy Fazbear's. Why do kids love it so? <laughs> Freddy Fazbear's. I. Who wants to get battered? I knew that there was Ultra. I knew that there was an episode like this. By the way. Hey you, barfing in the ball pit. Gary's on the case. I'm gonna get that badger. <laughs> there was a machine called Life Avoider. <laughs> this is it, Seuss. A lifetime of loneliness. Aww. Huh. Never seen that one before. Dating game. This is the third time someone's brought it back, and there's a note on it that says destroy at all costs. <laughs> Table flip! I love that. We'll take our chances. Okay. Year 2000 electronics. When the cherry petals of magic romance oh, this is so are cool. in bloom, anything can had plan. That is so true. <laughs> oh, uh, hi there. My name is Doki Doki Literature Club. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow, I'm learning. What the frick? So. Like to talk about. I'd rather just click your face. Is that the Plunk const constant as well in the back? So just to clarify, I knew that FNAF and Doki Doki, Doki Literature Club came after, obviously. <laughs> but I, I've seen the FNAF iceberg, and uh, one of the things was FNAF in Gravity Falls coincidence. So I know about this. But Doki Doki Literature Club? Hey, have you guys seen Seuss? We're supposed to help him with matchmaking today. Yeah! I wore my motivational sweater and everything. Oh. It's the first time he's missed work ever. Oh no. Every time you compliment me, I get another highlight in my eyes. Uh, you're pretty. <gasps> and pixely. <gasps> and so agreeable. <laughs> <laughs> Zeus? Oh, oh, hey dudes, come in. This game is amazing. I'm making eye contact, going on dates, and I haven't seen any natural sunlight for 13 hours. Zeus, maybe it's time to apply these skills with real girls. But I'm about to meet her parents. Her dad is an octopus man. <laughs> <laughs> Average FNAF fan. <laughs> I swear. Zeus, <laughs> you don't have to wish it goodbye. Game. Come on, Seuss, touch some grass. Yes, it's not like I'm going anywhere. Hello. Oh. Time to read Seuss's diary. What? <laughs> okay. Tiffany. Oh man, I'm so relieved to see you. Although, sort of confused. Oh, Seuss, I am not an ordinary game. I am. Interesting. The programmers try to delete me. That gives me portal vibes. That's not important. What's important is you don't have to talk to real girls ever again. You and me can be together forever. Together forever? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Dude, that's awesome that you're a grown man riding a little train like that. You're totally like owning it. I just want to ride tiny trains all day. Same. Well, at least you get to work at Meat Cute. Extreme lunch meats are the food of the future. I feel the same way. Hoo-ha Hoo -ha Owls Pizza, Pizza Matronic Jamboree. Jamboree! What? You've heard of Hoo-ha Owls? I love that place. Oh, right? she's doing this. I'm right in this mall. I should show you something. It's a good sign. I'm free around eight. Boom. Done. Yes, Zeus. Get in. Oh. What a nice lady. Well. Back to riding this tiny train for Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> we saw the whole thing, Seuss. That was amazing. You talked to a real girl. That was really amazing. That was like a natural. Hey, Giffany, we uh we gotta talk. Of course. Oh, come on. The girl out there will just make fun of you. You you really think so? Come on, Seuss. You're better than this. 
after. I won't let another girl take you away from me, Stephanie. Stephanie, calm down. That's a bit terrifying. I'm taking you back to the video game store after my death. I mean, if this is anything like Fight Fighters, I think I know what's coming next. I think I might be right. <laughs> no more Colombian nights. All right. <laughs> what? <laughs> you can do this. Soon. Okay. Just remember what your love crew I love the hat that she's How wearing. Nice. What are her stories? Interesting. And who's going to pay for dinner? Sushes. Now date. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, I just sort of say whatever pops into my... Uh... Compliment her. Oh, for God's sake. I got a big problem, guys. I'm being stalked by Giffany. Giffany? Or maybe it's pronounced Giffany. <laughs> I get it. Giff or Jiff. She's not real. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. This is like a FNAF story, honestly. Oh my god, I love it! <laughs> I love it! Oh, is she gonna possess the animatronics? Hello, friends. Hoo-ha the owl is dead. Oh no! This is insane! What? This is a, re a really cool concept for an episode. Purchased a dating simulator that attained sentience and went crazy. Oh, I am crazy. Crazy for you. Sue. That's sick. That was such a sick shot. They're being so creative with this show. I'll fix this. It's me that she wants. I'll distract her while Dipper and Mabel keep you safe. It's the only way. Seuss, these are children. <laughs> Stay back, you monster. <laughs> Come on, Stan. You got it in you. I know you do. <laughs> of course. Yes, yes! Get him, Goldie! Get him! Burn the child! Think about it. Real girls are unpredictable. They judge you. You really think Melody is going to take you back? But they're human. That's the thing. I can download your brain into the game with me. And we'll be together forever. <laughs> Stop saying that. All I can think of is FNAF. No, wait. Hmm. I'm not sure I like that ending, but okay. They just went into the pit, by the way. <laughs> Have you been following us all day? Seuss's life is my soap opera. <laughs> oh yes, Dan. Nice. Rich people water. Cool. Wow. That was great. That was a really cool episode. I just really liked um I just really liked the theme of that episode. Um Fight Fighters was was funny, but it I, I, I like it was it was like a above average episode, uh, but it wasn't like one of the top ones. This is a really amazing episode. Like genuinely, all of the season two episodes so far have been really really good, like top notch. Um, I didn't get a freaking key. Oh my god! Like I was genu I was looking in the background for most of that and I didn't see it. So um here we go again. But uh sure, let's let's start with the the final Oh my god, it's really long again. Um let's start with the final screen. So interestingly, right, this is the bottom right. Okay, so here we have this. It's right here. And then this actually goes here. So, 
That begs the question, I've, I have not sized this correctly. That begs the question, does that mean that next episode, we're gonna have the other half of a triangle here? If so, what, what does that even do for us really? I also, I'm a bit confused because I feel like this sock one, I feel like that is like a different hue to everything else. It's like a little bit darker. Right, maybe that's just the the video like quality that I've got this from, but I don't know. Um, but interesting that we uh, we have bottom right corner now, so we we do have four corners technically. It's just like what comes in between is is actually a mystery to us. Um, so let's solve this number code. Right, I have the full thing here. So let's, uh, what am I looking at? Oh, here we go. Winning hearts by daylight, possessing robots by moonlight. Her emotional baggage is a real fright. She has the one name Giffany. Okay. <laughs> it's like, uh, okay, great. Uh, cool. I mean, we already knew her name, but sure. I just, I think the reason I found that so weird is because it's winning hearts by daylight, possessing robots by moonlight, her emotional baggage is a real fright, she has the one named Giffany. It, it doesn't rhyme. Uh, unless I've missed something, but no, that that is the end of the code. Uh, yeah, so that's, it, it feels a bit strange to me, but okay. Um, that's cool though. I, I like that. I like that all of these are poems. It's it's really actually it, it adds to it quite a bit. Luckily, this code is shorter, uh, so it it will not take long at all when we get the key. Bloody hell! <laughs> this, is, <laughs> this is the worst. This is the absolute worst. I cannot believe I have missed every single key in every single episode so far. It's just like, it's so difficult to find because in the in the places you least expect in the background and like you, you, you're never looking for it in the moment when you need to. It's, it's yeah. Um, but let's have a look. Well, that took too long. <laughs> oh, these videos take too long to make now. They make, they take, it takes so long to find the key. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Oh my God, okay. So it's, it's Barrow, which I'm, I, I've literally just put two and two together. I was wondering why the bear creature looks so familiar. This this bear creature, it's it's the mascot of um it's it's the puppet that Mabel had in one of the Dipper shorts. Um Hello, I'm Barrow or something like that. I don't know what the voice line was. Um but the key is Barrow. It's in the kitchen. And it's like 20 minutes in. So I went through this basically frame by frame. Um, <laughs> there, there's some really cool stuff in here, by the way, that um, that I want to go through in an, in, in an analysis video properly. Um, but I, I just, I can't. I, I'm just sat here like beep, 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 Oh, geez. Okay. Um, but yeah, it's like, what, what else can I do? Uh, there's no other way really to find the key than to just go frame by frame and look at every single pixel on the screen. But that was a hard one to find. Doesn't he, I feel like he moves in front of it as well. Um, like it's, yeah, no, he's stood in front of it initially. And then, so how long 
does he stand there? It's on the screen for less than a second. How am I ever going to pick that up? I don't know. That's ridiculous, but uh, Barrow is our key. So let's take this. I am a little bit annoyed, <laughs> but uh, it's it's just the way it is, you know. Uh, I have to accept it. Barrow, and, 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 oh my gosh. Anything can happen. Why is it so messed up? Barrow. What? Why why is it like this? How, is it has it messed up? And thy ding can had plen. Oh, well I think it is anything can happen. Uh, I'm confused at that one, guys. I'm confused. Um, unless my thingy has messed up, which, like, I really hope it hasn't. Anything... Wait, any... Oh, it's not anything can happen. Um... What? An... Ant, ant hiding, <laughs> ant hiding can had plen. Great. Um, unless it's scrambled. Um, I don't know. Or, or the cipher's changed. Has the cipher changed? It better not have. <laughs> I'll, I'll say that much. I, it better not have. I will be so angry. Not actually. Um, but what? Yeah, guys, I have no idea. Uh, to me, that looks correct. Any and 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 hiding can hap had plan. Like anything can happen. I don't know what that means. I have. No idea. Um, so this is another point in the show where I'm saying, you can let me know. You can let me know what that means if it, if it doesn't spoil things. Like, don't, don't, obviously don't tell me if it's spoilers for future episodes or whatever. But, um, but tell me what that is. Uh, why not? <laughs> All right. Three hours in. <laughs> Genuinely. <laughs> we're, we're back at the three hour mark. Oh my god, these videos take so long to edit as well. You have no idea how long the, these videos take to edit. Anyway, we're on to episode number six, and let's go. Come in, come in, but be warned. <laughs> if you enter, you may be subjected to my tales. Tales designed to sell my merchandise! <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. Sorry, I was thinking of something funny I heard earlier. <laughs> what? Okay, interesting start. Ha 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 I'm trying to come up with new ways to do it. Obviously it's not working. Ha 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 What is that? Not a fan. Too many orifices. Not <laughs> this disembodied hand. Why is it so expensive? Well, that's quite a tale, and it's called Hands Off. No, seriously, hands off. That's not for sale. What are we? All right, Hands Off. What was that? Um. Oh, it's another one of these episodes. It's like the bottomless pit. Okay. Look at these faux gold beauties. They're mob boss quality. Is that a gold watches for old men magazine? Get your hands off my watch! Ah. Yeesh! Uncle Stan, are you seriously shoplifting from a witch? 
<laughs> Curse! Hey, anyone want to buy a wet blanket? We got a wet blanket for sale. <laughs> I can't survive in this market. <laughs> I can't survive in this market. What happened to your head? So I might have got cursed a little, but the watch looks nice, right? Leaving <laughs> hands find a wicked face. You must return what is it yours? That's better. Uh, <laughs> you gotta give that watch back and apologize. Why is what always just under the table? Ah! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Stan, did you just tap my shoulder? Kid, I can't tap anything. <laughs> Guys, can you stop tapping? Oh, my it's shoulders? hands off the mountain or something. Jesus! I didn't think that'd be so scary. <laughs> oh boy. Look at this touching scene. I saw that coming a million miles away. That the curse can only be broken by a kiss. What? <sighs> it's all right, kids. Just look away. <laughs> Forget it! I'm not kissing any of that mess! I don't need my hands that bad! Yeah, you're just making stuff up now. Let's go, kids. No, wait, don't go! Uh, you're right, you're right. Uh, I was just making all that stuff up. <laughs> what? And, you know, it's so hard to meet people these days. <laughs> what? You just need to redecorate. For example, a handelabra! A handelabra, that's amazing! Okay. Oh, Michelangelo, is it? That made that? Uh, that's a bit gross. Shaky, scratchy. I've missed you old <laughs> Shaky and scratchy. <laughs> oh, this is funny. Girl, are those space pants? Because your butt looks out of this world. Wow, thanks for noticing. Yes! <laughs> sure he doesn't look magic but there's a very interesting story i'm about to make up is that not waddles oh he's making up okay so this isn't canon solve this test of intelligence stressor act and annoy angle the what what a hecahedron may may and the hog coming at you on the am whoa <gasps> May May and the Hog, I love it. Buried okay. Near the falls is the legendary perception room. Whoa. That's cool. Tomorrow, I own you. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh no. I feel smarter already. The digits of pi are 3.1 um, four, four one five nine two six, etc. What? Who said that? Five three. Oh, Dipper, look! <laughs> Greetings, friends. It is I, Waddles the pig. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't right. The pig goes oink. The pig goes oink. The pig goes oink. <laughs> I see that now. Go on without me. Oh, shit, Mabel. Mabel just doesn't want to grow up, does she? That's. I think that's her motivation throughout the series. Dude, that rocket pack we made was amazing. Uh, so it, it turned from Mabel and Waddles to Dipper and Waddles. Waddles will be able to solve all the greatest puzzles of the universe. The origin of life, the meaning of existence. Why dudes have nipples? <laughs> True. I have no idea why I have them. Brain junk has made you forget who you are. Don't you remember us? Oh. Remember those times. 
<laughs> Amazing. <laughs> In my last eight seconds of consciousness, I want you to know that science is a horizon to search for, not a prize to hold in your hand. Also, I miss getting my tummy tickled. <laughs> oh. Oh, this is stupid. <laughs> well, that just put me 90 minutes closer to death. Time you kids learn to watch the classics from my day. Ooh, old people movies. Get ready for references we don't understand and words we can't repeat. <laughs> True. You're no match for going Clothocles. I've come for the golden pants. That's so cool. Get a look at your figurines. They're gonna be real, aren't they? For the last time, there is nothing here to be afraid of. That's so sick! <laughs> oh, this animation is so cool. I'm in love with it. Are we in Clash of Clans? <laughs> they look like the skeletons. What about stop motion? What? Do you really believe someone moves these figures one frame at a time? <laughs> love that. It was great at first, but one day... I love that because... <laughs> oh, I see. I, I love that because uh, they animated this frame by frame, obviously. Claymation, it's really well done. Face your fears, Mabel. Hey, I changed it into something I like. Whoa, I think I have an idea. Oh, you could remodel it. Talking to you, dumb dumb. Come at me. <laughs> nice. Mountain dorks. It's playback time. <laughs> oh, great. This is an impressive fight, though. I'm glad I'm facing towards it. <laughs> this is an impressive fight. I'm glad I'm facing towards it. <laughs> we can only see the shadow. Uh, they must have had a limited budget. I'm kidding. They, yeah. It's just a joke. None of us got turned into clay. Holy Toledo! Who wants to see me change into most anything? Oh my god. I can walk through walls. Whoa, whoa. We're safe now, kids. We're safe. <laughs> I'll have something new for sale very soon. Oh. <laughs> oh Jesus, that's a bit dark. And here we have our latest attraction, the legendary Cheapskate. I saw it blinking. <laughs> Just an optical illusion. Come along, everyone. Again, it's like a FNAF story. All right. I didn't see a key. <laughs> I did not see a key. Again. Ah, They're so hard to find. Um, right. So let me do the end screen first. So this was called Little Gift Shop of Horrors, um, which, you know, it, that's an appropriate title, I think. Uh, is it still a visionaire cipher? I would assume so. Uh, I'm seeing a lot of clay here. I, I know it's probably not clay, but there you go. Um, that was a long code as well. Uh, we'll solve, solve that in a bit. Um, that's an interesting screen. So we have Bill Cipher in the corner. We have more alchemy, I would only assume. Uh, we have a six-fingered hand here, another like stamp sort of thing, and then we have the numbers, and this, yes, we have the rest of the triangle. Okay, so it looks like we've got a full, um, a full puzzle piece completed, I guess. So, I paste this in here, and then I make it smaller. And then here we go. So I, I I just want to quickly talk about that episode. I thought it was really good. Um, 
I I thought the uh, the jokes were quite effective actually. I I actually quite enjoyed it. Uh, obviously, it's non-canon. Um, I I wouldn't I wouldn't really call it canon. Um, I mean, okay, it's canon, but it's it's not. It's 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 Grunkle telling stories, so it's like the narrator isn't reliable almost. But here you go, you've got like a a triangle here, so that's cool. Um, what did it do for us? Don't think it really did anything. Um, I can go into Photoshop and make this prettier, um, but I'm not going to do that right now. Let's solve this number code. All right, we've got a shorter one. This is the shortest one so far. Thank goodness, because I'm tired of the long ones. <laughs> uh, okay, so decoder, and then we paste in here. All animation is black magic. Ah, okay. That's a cool one. All animation is black magic. All right, so now is the, uh, the horrible part of finding the key. See you in two hours. I don't think, um, I don't think it's here. I've, so here's the issue, right? Literally, I just went through this whole thing frame by frame. And I didn't find anything. So has the cipher changed? Because usually I pick, like, unless I've just completely missed it. All right, I'll tell you what. It's getting way too late. <laughs> way too late. I need to keep my voice down because it's getting so late. Um, so I think we're going to end it here. And next time in my next analysis video, um, which I think I have a special surprise for next video, by the way. So... Uh, be sure to tune in for that. But next video, we will solve that code, hopefully. I, d I just don't really know what to do right now. Um, I guess I could look, I could go back to the intro and the backwards whispers and hear if it's still um, <laughs> gay visionaire or, um, or if it's changed. Um, but I didn't see a code. I didn't see a key. And... I'm going to be honest, I cannot be bothered to keep looking right now. So I'm going to end it here, I think. These were three really cool episodes, though. I'm really glad that season two is is looking to be amazing. Like, I, I think that I think we've got some big episodes to come. Obviously, it seems we've had we've had like a pattern almost. It seems episode one was big. Episode two, it was like, um... Well, it was still big, actually. Episode two was still big. Episode three was like a, a kind of rest episode, kind of like a joke around episode. And then episode four, we kind of went back and now it's a big episode again. We, we see Bill Cipher and there's some whole stuff about like possession and stuff like that. Episode five, I wouldn't say it's big, but like it was, it was pretty um, story centric. Um, well, not story centric, but... It was it was a standard episode. Okay, fine. I'll I'll say it was a standard episode. My theory is kind of wrong. I was going to say every third episode we get like a like a a normal episode, but yeah, whatever. Um but yeah, we had three pretty cool episodes today and I'm really excited to continue with the series. And that's it. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. So I will say no more, I don't think. Um, guys, thank you so much for watching once again. Um, and I, I really appreciate all of you for watching. I really appreciate all of my members. And I will see you in another video. Goodbye.